Hi everybody, I am here with a quick review from Clean Colors La Femme Cosmetics and these are the lipsticks, they're called La Femme lipsticks and basically they are like these really nice colorful um, lipsticks so I just firstly want to put out there that um, this is um, just my honest review, this is not a product that was sent from Clean Color to me. Um, I'm just giving you my honest opinion and I hope that you guys enjoy and find this video very informative. So the first lipstick that I have here is like this really nice purpley um, lavender color. It's called Cast a Spell in number 6. And I'm just going to quickly do like a lip swatch of it so you guys can see what it looks like. So this is basically the first swatch that we have here and what I like about it is that it went on fairly nice, it's fairly pigmented, um, it reminds me a bit of the Nicki Minaj Viva Glam 2, um, it has a nice scent to it, also it's, there's not a lot of creasing or anything like that and from what I can see in my mirror, it actually looks like it's, like the color payoff is coming off really nice so um, yeah, I appreciate this one. This is really cool. Okay, so the second one that I have here is Jewelry Box, and it's like, it's probably coming up on my camera as like a really nice green, but it's more like a cyan type blue. Um, that's it there. I'm sorry if it's blurry. And I'm just going to go ahead and swatch it on my lips for you guys. is more so a little more crazier um, it's a lot brighter I'd probably wear this if I was going out partying with my friends or something like that but again the color payoff with this is really good as you guys saw I just went like twice and that was it um, you could most likely tone it down with um, with probably an eye pencil or something like that or mixing it with another color that's it there the only thing that I don't like is that it is definitely cr like creasing a lot into my skin but I will definitely probably do like an ombre lip with jewelry box so we're just going to move right ahead on to the next one. Okay so moving on to the next one, this one is Lightning Struck and basically it's a yellow and I kind of heard bad reviews about this one. So we're just going to see what it looks like. Now if it's really not even showing up, more so on my bottom lip and you could see like all the chafing and everything that my lip has going on. Unfortunately I was in the hospital but whatever. So this one definitely is a waste. So. So we are moving back into the blues and this one is Skydive and it is more of a baby blue. Personally to me it feels like it's going to take like a lot to fill it in which I don't even want to get into because I'm seeing it on camera and I'm already feeling self-conscious about it. I don't like it. Um, again, I would personally, when it comes to my blues, I would definitely do like an ombre with the two of them. That way I feel more comfortable about it but personally I don't like it. It feels like it's moving a lot already. Um, yeah, it transfers really 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 quickly it's very 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 light but um yeah it's that one's not for me okay so the fifth one that I have is pink seeker and it's basically like a very standard magenta pink it's picking up as a neon pink on my camera just because of the lighting um it got really beat up though because it like it fell down the stairs today so there we go. Yeah, it got 
it got a whooping today, unfortunately. Personally, I'm not gonna rule this one out. Um, it's lightweight, which I like for the summer, and it gives me that nice sheer pinky tone to make it look like I'm wearing um, like a lip gloss, but it's a little bit heavier than lip gloss because there's a lot of wax in it. So the pink seeker is not bad. It has a nice scent and everything. All of them have a nice have a scent to it. Surprisingly, the yellow one smells like banana, but. I'm not going to be wearing this as okay, the garbage. Okay, so I just wanted to say about these lipsticks, just give you a little bit of insight. These lipsticks are $1.99, which is not breaking your bank, but um, personally, I would most likely stick, if you're going to get any three, I would definitely pick the Cast a Spell, which is basically like a dupe of the Nicki Minaj. Pink Seeker, because for me, it's sheer, which I like, but People who have lighter lips, for all I know, it could be a lot more pigmented, you never know. So I would definitely try that. And it's good for the summer because it's not that heavy. And if you want something fun and you don't want to spend like the $15 that Lime Crime is selling one of their lipsticks, I would definitely get the jewelry box if you're into that. Anyway colors. guys, I hope you guys found this review and swatches very helpful. Um, let me know if you have any questions, comment below, and I will also leave a link to where I purchased my um, lipsticks from. So I will talk to you guys in another video. Bye!